Hi, I'm Ashley Tita. Orange status. Um, I have been doing unique for about three years now. Um, and I was like party, party queen. I loved parties. I loved dead parties. I was all about the parties. And recently I switched to affiliates. Um, and it has been such a game changer. It's so funny, you guys. Okay. <laughs> Quick backstory. I, I do not get that nervous to go live on my Facebook, but for some reason seeing all of these faces makes me want to vomit. So it's fine. It's fine. I've already gone pee like 30 times. I'm fine. Oh my gosh. It's actually a heating pack. I have the, I've had the worst rib pain. Anyways. So affiliates, I don't know if you guys, I'm going to just kind of go from like the beginning, how I get them, what I do with them and all of that stuff in between. So if you have a notebook, I'd suggest probably grabbing it and taking some notes. I'm pretty sure this is recorded. So obviously you can always, well, <laughs> that's funny. Okay. <laughs> can you go watch that? Thanks, babe. Okay. So I, the first thing I want to say before I even like do any of this is just like with parties, just like when we would do parties all the time, you're going to have crap parties. You're going to have crap affiliates. You're going to have dead affiliates, you know, affiliates that don't post, you know, affiliates that, you know, don't do what you tell them. You're going to send them like a script and they're going to just like not actually do what you said. It happens. It's totally normal and it's okay. So get that, just get that off your chest. It's okay. It's going to be fine. I have weeks where I have like no sales from my affiliates. And then I have weeks where I get tons of sales and it's just kind of the way it works. I don't know. So how I get my affiliates, I am going to quick open up my notes. Oh, got really close. So I have different ways of getting affiliates. I, um, I will usually make a post on my wall that says something like, what I suggest doing is get some really awesome selfies where you're like, you know, something really crazy that's like eye catching. Um, and make a post that says, I'm looking for a couple people that are willing, that would be willing to post on their wall um, in exchange for some freebies from me. Um, something along those lines. Here's a couple other scripts that I've used. Um, sorry, guys, let me see. Okay. I'm looking for 10 affiliates for my number one product. It's completely free. Give me a high five if, um, and tell me, give me a five and I'll tell you how easy it is. So then people will just comment. Um, and I can put these in like the comments in Lash Money, but just like a bunch of different ways to get them. You know, we used to do the free makeup post. You could do free samples. Um, you could have like a bunch of our, um, I don't have any on hand, but you could have a bunch of like our mask samples, or you could have like the masks in your hand and be like, who wants free samples of my favorite mask? You know, like something along those lines, okay? You've got stories that you can use, okay? That is like so mega huge right now. Get in the stories and do a poll. Who loves free stuff? and do like a, do not put no for stuff. Okay. So there's options. There's yes or no. Change it to like, heck yeah. Or, oh my gosh. Yes. Right. Something along those lines. So it's a yes, no matter what. And then message those people. Um, and what I message them is, um, actually, let me show you, tell you one other way that I book them. You can also send messages. Birthday messages are a great way to get them because you can send the birthday message either the day before or the day after their birthday. Don't send it on their birthday. Tip number one, because they're getting flooded with so many messages on their birthday. So if you really want to show up in their inbox, send it before or after. All you have to say is like a, you know, Hey Rita, happy birthday. And then it's like, thanks girl. And then you can respond back with, Hey, I'd love to set you up with an exclusive affiliate link, um, this week for your birthday. And then she's going to say, what's that? Okay. Or just, Hey, would you like to be one of my exclusive affiliates this week? Just ask. It doesn't hurt. It's free. They don't have to, you know, literally hardly do anything. Um, and what I send them 
Um, and you can obviously change this, make it your own wording. Oh my gosh, sorry, I have so many, so many notes. Um, I say interested, post with bigger face and hair. Here's my face okay. <laughs> you guys have like so many notes on your phone. Um, why doesn't it show up? Opportunity follow up. Um, you guys are like, what are you doing? Okay, they're not, I, I don't see it in my notes. So I'm gonna just go to my most recent affiliate and I will tell you what I say to them. So I sent them, and I can post this in Lash Money as well. I send them, um, hey, thanks for commenting on my post. Or, hey, thanks for voting in my poll. Um, or obviously, if they just said, hey, I'm interested, or hey, can you tell me more info? I would say, okay, so I have some happy mail with your name on it. All I need, um, all you need to do is post a photo on your wall for six days. Don't worry, I will send you exactly what to post, and it's super, super easy. When the six days are done, if you've posted each day, I will get you some fun mail. I will get your fun mail out. An honest way to you. So fun and so easy. I'm only taking five at this time. This is key, okay? Or say two or three, whatever. Um, so let me know for sure if you're in or out. I'll just need your email and shipping address so I know you're in. Okay, so why I say I only have five spots. You wanna make it seem like this is exclusive. This is like, you wanna get in here, right? So give them a number. If it's two, it's two. Obviously, you can do more than that. I usually have about 15 going every week, just because I know of that 15, there's probably gonna be five that aren't gonna actually post. So kind of like know that those are the numbers. It's about, I would say a third, don't actually do anything. Um, so I personally send them, a quick show you because I actually have, this is all of mine from January, you guys. I have so many that did affiliates for me this month. I have like well over $1,000 in PRS and it's only from mascaras. So I am sending them, and these got all wet, just so you guys know, my water spilled on them. So I am sending them a mask sample. Love these because they're a dollar and you can put them in an envelope. And it's so easy and it's so easy to follow up with them and say, hey, did you get your happy mail? Did you see your mask? What'd you think? Boom. I also send them one of these little cards, which I love that Unique has. I think they're still in the, um, I think you can still order these, not 100%, but they're those little perfume cards. And I spray the blue perfume because it's my favorite. And then you can mark which one it is on here. So then when I follow up with them, I know what one I sprayed on there and it smells so freaking good. <laughs> okay, so then I do that. Then I send them this cute little, I had this, um, I just literally printed this on photo paper from Walmart. And I thought if I do it in a square, it looks a little more like bougie than four by six. And I have on here my website and a picture of my family. And it says, thank you so much for supporting my small business. It means the world to me. Um, it does say post a selfie on your Facebook wall, tag me for 10% off your next purchase because I do send these as thank you cards. But what I did, cause then I was like, oh shoot, it says 10% off. Now what? I put on here on my thank you note that I sent them. I said, Hey, thanks so much for being my lash affiliate this week. You're so amazing. I'm going to offer you 10% off your next order in January. Okay. So they have 10% off an order in January. So what does this mean? I have somebody to follow up with now. Not only to follow up and check and see how they liked their mask, what they thought of that magical scent, but now also I wanna ask them, hey, you know, there's only a week left in January, do you wanna get an order in? I'm a little late to the game on sending these out, so I'm hoping that I'll get that time. Um, otherwise I'll just tell them, you know, it's for February, whatever. Um, but 10% off is not that bad. You're still earning commission. Um, but then they're getting a discount and then they get to try something, even if it's as simple as a mascara, it's so worth it in my opinion, because you can follow up with so much opportunity, affiliate, um, anything, you know? Um, so that is what I do to all of my affiliates. They have to post every single day though, to get this happy meal. So what's cool about this is during your post. So let's say you've got seven girls posting. 
Okay. You've got all these people that said, yes, you put their name down, you got their email, you got their address. There's like three of them that aren't posting. Send them a message and say, Hey, you know, Hey lady. Hey, Rita, Rita, sorry. Your face is right there. Um, uh, I've got your happy mail sitting on my desk. I noticed you didn't post yesterday. I just want to check one more time. Were you still interested in being an exclusive affiliate this week? Just check in because a lot of the times you guys, life happens. They forget. Maybe they're kind of like unsure about it and they want to ask you another question, but offer it one more time. Don't feel like just because they didn't post, they're like writing you off. Just check back in. So now you guys know how I get them, right? I do birthday messages. You can send a message. You can make a post. You can do a poll. All of those different ways, okay? You give them, give them a sample. Give them like a 10% discount. If you don't want to buy the samples, do a 10% discount. Like, hey, I'm offering a discount just for being my exclusive affiliate this week. All you have to do is blah, 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 blah. I will put all of my wordage and everything in Lash Money so you guys have it. Um, obviously make it yourself because you don't want, if it doesn't sound like you don't, don't use it. Um, so what else, what else? Um, so now I've got my party or got my affiliates. So I always start mine on like a Sunday or a Monday because I have them go for six days. I really want there to be a Friday. Got to make sure there's a Friday in there because most people have a Friday payday. Um, and so I have them post for six days now you can do anything, you guys. If mascara is not your jam and you are like foundation freak, do a do a um a foundation affiliate week. You don't have to just use mascara. I think that we like get in our heads that we have to use like the same thing everybody else is doing. Just because it works for one person does not necessarily mean it's gonna work for you. I don't love 4D mascara, so I use Epic mascara, and that's my favorite. It's always been my favorite. Does that mean my customers aren't gonna buy 40 from me and I'm not gonna talk about it? No, but my affiliates are mostly just talking about Epic Mascara. Now, when the spray foundation comes back, I will be doing spray foundation affiliates. <laughs> um, but honestly, if you love liquid touch, do liquid touch. If you love the stick, focus on the stick for a week. I love that there are so many different faces that we can use on, um, on, a, on these posts. You guys, there's so many different people that love our products and they post selfies and you can use those. So I do use my face at least one of the days. Um, but most of the others, I, it's not my face, it's someone else, you know, and I make sure it's make sure that the posts, I noticed that this is really big for me. If the mascara post is just lashes, like it's just a girl looking up, it's good. But when they're holding the tube is so much better because then they trust that it's actually that product. So find ones that where they're holding the liquid foundation or they're holding the stick foundation, or, you know, they've got like it drizzled on and whatever. Okay. So, um, give them a post every single day. I make sure they have to post at 8 PM in their time. I usually say 8 PM or around that time, your time. Um, because I feel like that's a really good time to post. Most people are kind of relaxed. They're kind of scrolling on Facebook. But you guys, affiliates are so great because think about it this way. Yes, parties are awesome and you should still do them. They're still great. But affiliates, you're, they're literally doing exactly what we do, but just, just to get a sample, you know, like they are literally doing exactly what we do. We are giving them a post and a picture. They're posting it on their wall for their audience, for us to like open up everything. So offering the opportunity in these is just magic. Okay, so I'm going to tell you what my first day affiliate sounds like. I send them this message. Um, so excited to get this rolling. So here's how things are going to work. Every night for the next six days, you will post the post I send over around 8 p.m. your time. You will attach the wording and the picture I send. Obviously, part of the message will be just for you, aka just like this part but you'll be able to tell where that actually, that part actual start, actually starts. Make sure to tag me. Okay. Love you. Make sure to tag me in the post or in the comments so that I can get notified and make sure I get your happy mail out. Okay. So they have to tag me in the comments of every post and I make sure to turn my notifications on when I get tagged. 
I also love that picture and I also comment on that picture. And I'm like, oh my gosh, my favorite mascara, or oh my gosh, love this, or um, oh my gosh, girl, whatever, you know, something. You guys, you have to be willing to put yourself out there. You have to be willing to also help that girl's post out a little bit, give it some love. Um, so turn the notifications on on that post, comment on it, love it, don't just like it, give it a heart or an O, <laughs> um, and then you are good to go on that. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Love it. Comment on it. Turn on notifications. Okay. So now what happens when someone comments? Someone just commented. Someone liked it. Two different people. The person that liked it, you can send them a message. Okay. Add them as a friend. Add all of the people that like it as a, as a friend. All of the people that comment as a friend. Just like when we did parties, you add the people that were added as a friend because they're obviously showing a little bit of interest. So now you add them so that they can now watch you all the time, showing up every day, okay? So send them a message. They liked it. They reacted to it in some way. You can send them a message and say, um, hey, Karen, I saw you liked Michelle's mascara post. Did you have any questions about it? Wow, that was really, really, really awkward. No, <laughs> it's not. And honest, I've had so many orders from messaging the people that are liking or reacting to it. Most people are like, well, they didn't comment. You guys, a lot of people don't want to comment because they don't want the notifications. They don't want, maybe they just don't want people to know they're interested. So you have to be willing to kind of do all of the dirty work. Um, so message them. Now, the biggest thing that I've noticed, the crappiest part about Facebook is a lot of the times these messages are going to a filtered inbox if you are not friends with them. So make sure you're adding them as a friend. And then what you can also do is you can actually tag them in the comments of that post. This is obviously pushing it if they haven't gotten back to you. You can, you can comment and tag them and say, you know, hey, Rita, um, I sent you a quick message. Now, I have a lot of people that asked me, um, or I guess girls on my team who had said that, you know, what happens when someone is showing interest, but won't jump. So I'm going to explain what I do, um, to help with that. So anybody that is interested, comments, interested, or shows some kind of interest in a comment, add them as a friend as well, send them a message. The message that I send them is a little bit different, obviously. I say, hey, I saw you comment on, I make sure to say the name, Michelle's Lash Post. I would love to get you some, some of that mascara, and I might even be able to throw you in some discounted shipping. So what I do is I actually take 10% off. You don't have to do this, okay? You don't have to do this, but this is what I do for my affiliates, okay? You could even take a dollar off shipping and just call it discounted shipping, and if you've got Y Cash, or use a dollar of your commissions you're gonna earn, whatever. But honestly, for me, it's kind of my way of being like, ooh, you, you commented on that exclusive link. And then I can follow up. Um, so I then, then they're like, oh, can you give me details? And I say, I'm so excited for you to give this a try. I am already assuming they are purchasing. I'm not asking, I'm not saying, oh, what about, or whatever, I'm not asking them questions. I am so excited for you to give this a try. I think you're gonna love it. Okay, so I have two options. I have a 40 mascara that's $29. It has little fibers infused, blah, blah, blah. Or I have a $24 Epic mascara. And then I explain that one a little bit. Really, really short. Like basically it just says, this is my personal favorite. It doesn't have the fibers. Still gives you length. Um, let me know which you're interested in and I will send you over an invoice. I send them an invoice. I order for everybody. I do not send them a link because every time I send someone a link, they don't order. <laughs> I would say maybe one, two, three out of every 15 order for themselves, but I would say most of the time they don't. So I end up following up and I'm like, hey, did you get, you know, did you get your order and I act all dumb. They're like, no, I, I didn't, not yet. So then at that point, I'm just like, hey, do you, you know, can I quick send you over an invoice and I'll get that order for you today? And then they order. So a lot of people just don't want to go through the whole steps of like placing it, even though we can easily send them the awesome, like little shopping cart, people still just don't want to do it. So anyways, I do all of that. 
I send them their tracking, which I love you guys. I love that we get the tracking because it makes it so easy to follow up. You know, hey, Crystal, just wanted to pop in. I got your tracking info. I'm so excited for your mascara. It's on its way. And then you can keep kind of up with them. You know, I usually say, hey, let me know when you get it so that, you know, I can hear, I, I can be excited with you. Something along those lines, okay? Um, every single person that comments, you need to tag them and say, hey, I'm sending you a message. Tag them. So you're going to comment. You're going to reply to that comment when they say interested. You're going to go the little at sign and start typing their name and it's going to come up. And you're going to say, hey, I sent you over a message. Make sure you send them a message first though. Um, and then that way they can say, hey, I didn't get it. And you can say, hey, try sending me a message. It'll show up. Okay. Um, let me think I'm going to go, um, I don't, okay. I didn't even see all these comments. If you guys have questions, you guys can shoot them over there and I'll try and answer when I'm all done, but, um, I'm going to try and keep talking as quickly as I can. I think I'm almost done. Honestly, I'm going to go over what I do then after. So I give them six posts. Okay. Posts for six days. I write, you guys, I 100% recommend grabbing some kind of notebook, having some kind of planner or something to keep you organized, because I will say affiliates can get a little bit overwhelming, especially when you have like 10. Um, so what I do is I have like my new affiliates for the week and I make a check mark and they're at the end of the six days, there'll be six check marks. And that's just me kind of reminding myself, like each person got their, their post. I will say you can give them their post at any point in the day, but I will say every single time I send it to them in the morning, even though it says post at 8 PM, they always post in the middle of the day. So if you want it posted at a certain time, try sending it maybe like two hours before. Um, so I try and send around six. Um, so then I send them their post, they get their six posts. Okay. So now it's the last day. Okay. And one thing I do that helps me because yes, I can go through all of these 15 people, but sometimes it's exhausting <laughs> to like figure out, did they actually post every day? So what I say is, um, here's tonight's post, post at 8 PM, tag me in the comments. I tell them that every night, you guys, just what I do. Um, if you posted all of the six days, let me know and I'll get your happy mail out this weekend. Here is your last and final post. So then they're like, yeah, I got to tell this girl that I posted the six days because I want my happy mail. Okay. So they always send me a message back and I'm like, yes, awesome. So that is, that's the last day. Okay. Then now opportunity, you're not sending opportunity messages to your affiliates. You are missing out on everything everything. You guys, these, these people are posting and doing what we're doing. It's so much easier to offer them the opportunity than ever before because they're actually doing what we're doing. So what I do for my follow-up opportunity. Okay. I say, hi cutie. That's how I talk. You don't say, Hey cutie to your friends. Don't say, Hey cutie. Okay. So this is what mine sounds like. Hey cutie. Okay. So I just wanted to quick thank you again for being an affiliate. You'll be getting your happy mail soon. But Hey, I had a quick question. Now that you see how easy it is to do what I'm doing, is this something you've ever thought about? No pressure either way. I just would feel awful if I didn't ask with a couple emojis. Emojis are real big in case you guys didn't know. Um, and I send that and you want to know something? I would say out of, let's say out of the 10 affiliates I have, two of them maybe ignore me. One of them maybe says no. A couple of them they say, you know what? I'm actually kind of interested. Can you give me more info? And a couple of them say, yeah, I've actually been thinking about it. You guys offer it this. And I'm telling you do it on the last day. Do it before they get their happy meal. Don't wait. Don't tell yourself, I'm going to do it tomorrow. I'm going to do it. Get it out of the way. Just get it. Rip that bandaid off and send it. Okay. Mine, I have to do it. Makes me feel organized. Um, so that is my opportunity follow-up. And then obviously you can go from there. They're going to ask you questions, blah, blah, blah. Um, but that is 
that's my affiliate week. That's, that's, that's what I do. Um, uh, ta, 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 ta. <sighs> certain time works best. Um, with the years you have done the affiliate posts, have you noticed a certain time that works best? So I've honestly only been doing affiliates for maybe like, I don't know, maybe this past year, I guess, maybe six months. Um, but honestly, I would say 8 PM their time is just a really solid time. Um, for most people, it's a very, like, I would say average, um, good time, but, um, but yeah, I think you'll just kind of figure it out. Is there anything I didn't cover that you guys can think of how I get them? My post, um, can you post all of your scripts and we can change them up? Yes. I will post them in like the replay, um, post and lash money. And that way you guys can see what I do. And like I said, there's so many different ways. Don't ever feel like just because, you know, this works for me, switch it up and make it you. If you guys are feeling like, um, I, I think I had someone had commented, like I've tried to get affiliates for so long. It never works. You guys have to keep trying, um, change it up, change your time. If 8 PM works for me, but it doesn't work for you, try it earlier, try it in the morning. And honestly, the biggest thing I've noticed is the dorkiest, nerdiest, weirdest selfies of myself do the best. Grab their attention somehow. Um, you have to remember, like people are scrolling literally like this on their Facebook. So you have to have something that's gonna stop them. You have to have something that's gonna grab their attention, you know, free samples. I want free samples. I love free stuff. I love free stuff. Okay. So that's what I recommend. Also the coolest part, obviously our free samples and all that stuff is tax right off. So holla and all that, but seriously, um, it's been awesome. And I think the follow-up from these has been probably my favorite because I am literally connecting with people I would have never connected with. Um, I had a girl from California messaging me today and she's like, oh my gosh, I've never heard of this mascara before. I'm so excited to give it a try. So she ordered and now we're like chatting back and forth. And I'm like, oh my gosh, can't wait for you to get it. Let me know. You guys, these are people that like I would have never talked to before. And I just feel like because of affiliates, <sighs> I feel like it's a little more personal. I feel like I can be a little more personal with it. Um, versus with a party, sometimes it's so overwhelming because there's like 300 people added and you're like, where do I even start? There's so many people to add. This is like, this is killer and this is gold, but make sure there's different ways to do it. Don't feel stuck on how Ashley's doing it or how Kylie's doing it. Make it you, um, change the wording until it makes sense for like, what's going to work for you. Um, change the time, change the way you're posting, change the way you're asking too. If you've been asking the same way week after week and it's not working, change it. Go in your polls and type something, you know, make a funny meme or, or whatever, do a face, I don't know. And just be like, you know, free stuff? Who wants free stuff? Something, just something, okay? <laughs> Go do it, who's gonna book some affiliates? <laughs> Seriously though, when you guys book them, you guys should comment in the replay when we post it and let us know that you're doing it. Cause it is, it's a game changer. It's really fun and it's cool. It's, it's really cool. That's all I got for you guys. All right, Kylie, your turn. Oh my gosh, you're my favorite person in the whole world. Uh, so um, yeah, yeah, that's great. 9.30, I'm gonna stop the recording and then we can ask questions and stuff. 